Tarnatia has an important historical, artistic and religious patrimony, a legacy of the faith anchored in the Christian devotion of local people. The chapel of San Vito was rebuilt in the 17th century, situated atop a more ancient structure, probably of medieval origin. The building is located along the road which links the town with Lecce. The small church has undergone many modifications over the centuries, and inside one can admire different devotional frescoes, particularly works highlighting the mortal Saint Vitus. The church of Madonna degli Angeli stands on the junction road between Stanatia and Galugnano. In the past, the sacred building was annexed to the small convent of the Franciscan monks, a religious community which has operated in Stanatia from the 16th century. The architectural firms are very simple and linear, as evidenced in the façade decorated with a small stone portal and a stone cross placed at the top. Very little remains today of the Franciscan convent yet the devotion of inhabitants is still alive, especially evident on the Thursday after Easter, with religious celebrations and recreational activities. The chapel of Madonna dei Farauli is situated along the rural road which leads to Martignano, and it takes the name of the district where it is located. The small church has an interesting portal decorated with two half columns and a distinctive pattern carved into the architrave. The church has undergone important modifications during the 20th century, but inside one can admire a variety of wall frescoes and an altar constructed in the 18th century by the sculptor Emanuele Orfano. The small religious architectures of Sternatia are located in the delightful countryside which surrounds the village itself and they are a witness to the ancient history of the inhabitants of this land.